Hey there everybody, welcome back to the channel and today we're going to talk about cellular data. Now the question is, we probably buy data for our smartphone to keep it for a long period of time. What happens when you see that your cellular data is really running out super fast? Well, if you're having this problem, don't worry because in this video we're about to give you a bunch of ways to save your data on your iPhone. Now the very first things I want you guys to do is very simple. Just simply go ahead and make sure to turn off your cellular data if you don't use them. Now what happens sometimes, people leave their cellular data for a long period of time even they don't really use it without even realizing it, their cellular data get consumed. Simply go ahead and turn it off if you don't use it. Alright, now let's talk about the second way of saving cellular data. Well, there are some applications available on your iPhone. You don't need to use those, especially for your cellular data, but all you can do is simply can turn those off in order to save your cellular data. Okay, and all you can do is simply can type your settings and then simply go ahead and open up your cellular. And here, if you scroll down here, then you're going to see some of this application. I mean, all this application will be appears here. Okay, now let's imagine you don't want to, you know, use no more internet for your let's say um, Google home for example or let's say you don't use your map pretty often you can turn it off from here in water to save your data but if you really want to use them back again you can struggle it on depending on when you need it and when you don't now this next way we're going to talk about is the low data mode well which is a built-in option for your iphone which allows you to keep your cellular for a very long period of time now let me just go ahead and open up the setting again and choose your cellular and then you have to choose either your primary or secondary option okay now here we are going to open up the secondary just to show you how it works now down here you're going to see this option called low data mode just go ahead and turn these features on now let me tell you this okay although turning these features on your iphone will give you let's say we will not really give you the super fast internet because turning this on will slower your internet okay you have to just you know learn to live with that and if you're just going to go ahead and just turn these features on your iphone it will help you to keep your data for a long period of time. Now let's go ahead and talk about another way of saving your internet on your iPhone. Now which of course is so called disable background app refresh. Now there's an option on your iPhone if you just go ahead and open up your settings and then scroll down to your general and then scroll down to your background app refresh. <laughs> go ahead and tap on there and here you're going to see all of this application will appear right here then just go ahead and simply turn this application off now what it actually does it actually secretly take your megabyte even when you don't use the application so turning all of this application will help you to save your data pack on your iphone all right guys now the next things we're going to talk about is the auto download now if you turn on the auto download option on your iphone it will consume a tons of megabyte on your iphone so all you can do is simply can open up your settings and then come down to your app store and then you're going to see this option now just go ahead and tap on there and here you're going to see this option called automatic downloads go ahead and just turn these features off and afterward no application will get auto download and at the end of the day you'll be able to save a tons of you know data pack or the cellular data on your iphone now afterward, there's a last and one more thing you just want to go ahead and take a look at is your locations. Now, sometimes you probably know it or not, but you know what, your locations, if you just turn it on, especially when you don't use it, that option secretly takes the megabyte. Now here, if you just open up your settings and then scroll down to your privacy, and then if you come down to your location service, just go ahead and turn these features off, especially when you don't use the location service on your iPhone. Now turning this off will help you a lot to save a tons of cellular on your iPhone. Alright guys, after doing all of the process, it will really help you tremendously, especially if you're using iOS 15, then it will help you a lot. Hope this video is really useful for you guys. If you think so, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel to get more useful video content for yourself. Thanks for watching and we will talk to you all later.